Hello YouTube and welcome to another Notepad++ tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how you can run C# -sharp script in Notepad++. So, are you ready? Let's get started. So in order to execute C# -sharp script under Notepad++, it's really easy. All you have to do is to install a plugin called C# -sharp plugin. So, as always, I will go to my Plugins menu, then Plugin Manager, then I will choose Show Plugin Manager. Okay. And from the list of available plugins, I will search for the C Sharp plugin. So, here it is, as you can see here. It's not my plus plus plugin for C Sharp script, so I will just click on this checkbox here and I will install so it will install very easily but I have to, to restart notepad++ ok so I hit ok and now it's restarting again so now you will notice a new menu has been added called C sharp script ok so in order to use that menu, I'll just open here an example, C Sharp script. So one of the good features of that uh, plugins actually is it can format my C Sharp script. So for example, if I have something like this and that, let me just change the... So you can see that my script now is not good formatted so if you want to format it like a pro all you have to do is to go to plugin then C sharp script then here is option called format documents so now as you can see my script has been formatted like a professional programmer okay so in order to run the script here, it's really easy. Always go to your plugins, then C script C sharp plugin, then to run it, you run it. And you will notice here. So now by default it's on the debug view, but you can just turn it to your console view. And this is the output, as you can see, this is my first C Sharp program because we have executed this script here using this plugin. Okay, and here on the left side, you can see all the references to the DLL that uh, was used by the program. And if you hover over a uh, name of Dynamic Lake Library, you can see its location. So here it uses actually two DLLs, system and system.link, okay. So of course it came with auto completion features and IntelliSense features. But in order that to work good you have to disable setting in Notepad++. So I'll go to setting preferences and here you can see the auto completion. You have to disable these features here to disable it in order that your plugin works well. So me, I already done that, so no problem. So now, like, you just type something like, for example, control then space. It gives me all the classes that I can use, for example, or the object that I can use. For example, if I choose console and if I hit points it gives me all the functions and the methods that I can use with this function here so I can just type something like uh, right link for example if I want so this is the Intel sense feature that you can use and here it's a method called right line right line actually so it's pretty easy plugin that you can use 
and that will turn your Notepad++ into an IDE C# -sharp interface. So that was just a brief introduction to this plugin here that can help you to perform a lot of things using C# -sharp. As always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye-bye!